This episode of Life Noggin is brought to you by AJ+. Hey there, I'm Blocko, and I might be an ageless animation, but you, on the other hand, are getting older every day. And with old age comes a lot of interesting changes. It's Thursday, so that means we're answering one of your questions, and this week we're gonna find out, why does hair turn gray with old age? Let's do this. Let's figure out how hair gets its color in the first place. Hair, like the skin, gets its color from a pigment called melanin. Did you know that melanin formation happens before we're born? Did you know that all hair is white before it grows? Well, you do now. Dark pigments are called eumelanin, and light pigments are called theomelanin, which blend together to create a broad spectrum of beautiful hair colors. These pigments are composed of cells called melanocytes that are positioned on the skin surface which the hair follicles grow through. Melanocytes inject melanin into cells that contain keratin, which is the protein our hair is made up of. There are many factors that can change the pigment of your hair, both internal and external. Things such as genetics, hormones, age, the climate that you live in, toxins, and even chemical exposure can all affect hair pigmentation. I would check with your parents or grandparents and find out when they went gray. That's when you probably will too. As you grow older, your hair turns gray as the result of failed maintenance of melanocyte cells. They may die or just function improperly. The less melanin you have, the grayer your hair becomes. Each hair follicle grows separately and contains its own amount of melanin. This is why certain hairs turn gray at different times. There is still no solid proof as to why this happens. More recent studies have shown the hair follicles produce small amounts of hydrogen peroxide, which over time can lead to a gradual loss of hair color. I personally would take gray hair over a hairless blockhead any day. Thank you so much for watching. As usual, I'll be answering a new question every Thursday, so ask anything you want to know in the comments or on Facebook and Twitter. If you like this video, you should definitely click the one that just popped up on the screen or check the description for the link of the pudding is in the eating. The meaning behind this expression is that to experience something to the fullest, you need to try it out yourself. Like pudding. Try it. You'll like it. Unless you're allergic somehow. I'm Blocko. This has been Life Noggin. Don't forget to keep on thinking.